Hey, what up, YouTube world? I'm just gonna. I'm out in the woods dumping out right now. My gorilla cart. This a uh, ten cubic feet gorilla cart. This the uh, one of the biggest ones they make. Uh, 1,500 pound capacity, and like I say, this one here has to hitch that you spin around to a turn or uh, to like a hitch hook to a bottom. But I, I pull mine out here behind my lawnmower, pretty much put it that way. But anyway, I'm pretty sure that's about 300 pounds. Now, I've had this thing loaded completely to the top with sand, and it took me and my wife to lift it up to dump it out. But while I'm out in the woods, I'm going to show you how this thing works. Like I said, I done had mine about a year and a half, and I actually used it. I really enjoyed it. And uh, there's a bunch of old broke-up sheetrock and insulation in there. Uh, you go right here, little latch right there. I'm going to show you how to dump it out. You just leave it right here. You pull it out, and you lift. Ah! You lift. Just like a dump truck. Then you go around to the front. I unhooked mine so I can show y'all how to work it. But see the frame? I'm going to pull it forward. Just like a dump truck. See all that? Most of it all came out. We're going to bump it a little bit. Pull it a little bit forward. <sighs> Jeez. Work a lot better if I had somebody holding the camera for me, but we're going to make it work for y'all. See there? It's all out. Just like a dump truck. Now this thing is a poly, it's a poly wagon. When I first got it, I thought it was flimsy. But this thing is stout. Like I said, I've had it loaded to here with sand. And I know I was, I was over a thousand pounds because my tires were about flat. Now hold on one second. Okay, YouTube, got my breath. Hit the handle again. I pulled it back up to the lawnmower and you got two quarter pins. I got one of them out already. See this right here? Pull this pin out. Pull, push this pin out. And the handle will spin around. Y'all see that? And I'm gonna put my pin back through here to lock it. Pay attention. One hand on it, y'all. Put the pin back through it. Ah, oh, come on. Put the car to key back in. I'm pretty good for one hand. All right, there we go. This is what we're gonna do. right there just like that y'all see how that handle swapped around right the handle back here now just spin around that's all it was and i'm gonna take my hold on hope I ain't getting no poison i have it take this other pinion drop it through here like i see it's this hell trying to run this camera with one hand Uh, and there you go. Look, lock back up again. And this is a Gravely lawnmower. It's a ZT60 HD. It did not come with this. I ordered this off eBay. This little hitch right here. I drew it three holes and lashed it on there. It probably cost me about $7, but it was worth it. Anyway, I got the wagon back hooked up again. If I go up here and get another load, y'all see how. Way back on the bush, that's probably I dumped about a year ago there. I put this on a property down here. I dumped it way back on the woods over there. So I hope this helps somebody out. Like I said, I had this thing about a year and a half. I really enjoyed it. Uh, had no problems out of it. In fact, my wife, sometimes she gets it. Puts a, I got a fifth or a 14 year old and a 10 year old. They get in there and she ride around the motor. I can't get her the motor yard, but she will drive it around the yard. But anyway. <laughs> They have fun with it, whoop de whoop. But uh, this 10 cubic feet gorilla cart, 1,500 pound capacity, and I really enjoyed it. It's been a big, big help, clean up. I actually, like I said, I bought it for sand to spray it for my pool. Then I had some uh, old slag put in my yard. I used it a little bit for that. But uh, it's been a real big help. It's real durable. 
And uh, I recommend this to anybody. Gorilla Carts. <laughs>